welcome back to another episode of Super Sim Challenge. If you haven't caught up with any of the previous parts, of course you can do so. I will link the playlist in that top corner up there. And if you want to hang out with me live, you can do so. I will link my Twitch channel below in the description, along with all my other socials, along with I have a brand new fan house as well, so you can come over and follow me over on fan house. It's, an, it's fun. It's a lot of fun. I'm having a lot of fun over there. But... Let me just quickly catch up with what's going on in this challenge. So I've played a little bit of it off camera. So basically we went through the graduation ceremony, um, that little bit of like limbo almost in between the graduation ceremony and when they kick you out and off of the campus. I've played through that because nothing really much happens. And I've moved her back into her old house in Willow Creek where she can now apply to her next degree and uh, we're going to do drama. I got the community to vote on it and drama won. So that will be our next one. We're going to do it at Brightchester and we are going to um, live in the little house. It's like, more like we did just now in Foxbury Institute. We're going to do the same thing but over at Brightchester. Let's get into the game because uh, someone, someone's living in our house and, and I want you to see who they are. So remember how this house, Farron moved into it? Well, Farron died, obviously. Um, I don't know who this is. This person right here, I have no idea who this is. Apparently their name is Pamela Huntington the third, but I don't know who I don't think that's the person who's living with us, is it? It is. Yeah, Pamela Huntington the third, who is a teenager, apparently, living by themselves in my old house. So I moved into my old house and she's just there. And uh, <laughs> We have a roommate, so that's fine. Um, I'm taking the bed though, Pamela. I'm sorry. Oh, look, my old equipment's here. My old workout equipment is here. Well, that's so cool. That gives us something to do because um, if you remember from last time when we moved back home to apply for a new degree, it can take about three days sometimes for the um, the degree to come back in the mail. It depends. It, it varies. So what I'll do is I'll get her to apply for the degree she can be working out while she's here to try and get that maximum body potential for her fitness aspiration. And then once she gets accepted into university, then we can move out. Um, but let's see, she, straight away, first thing we're going to do is we're going to apply for scholarships. Okay, so if we go to... Oh, hang on, I'll skip past it. There we are, Moo University. Scholarships, apply for scholarships. And then we'll see which ones are available to us. I am not going to accept the fitness one. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, no. No, not the athletics ones. No. <laughs> Sims who are skilled in athletics can apply to the scholarship. Sims must also participate as a soccer team player. No, no, no. It's fine. We don't know. Um, building the future. Oh, yes. We can apply for that one for our handiness skill. That's cool. I think we're handiness level six, I believe. Just before filming, I just updated the spreadsheet as well, so that should be updated. Oh no, we're only handed a level four. Ah, well that's okay then, isn't it? Um, what else can we apply to? Let me see. Apply for scholarships. We can apply for esports, but I don't want to do that because that's another similar thing to the football team where you have to go and take part in things in an evening. Although it might be fun to do something like fun and different. We know from experience now how much that eats into your time, so we'll leave that one for now. Um, we'll do we'll do few, food and drink, we'll do future star, we'll do great outdoors, and we'll do Willow Creek scholarship. So I'll just do all of those quickly. Okay, so that's everything applied for apart from the esports and the soccer team one. So what I'm going to have her do? God, this house is so dusty. You know what I need her to have in her inventory? I've decided she needs to have a vacuum cleaner because. Um, she doesn't have one. When she's at university, if the halls get dirty, she's going to need to clean it there as well. So we'll go into build mode super quick. And I'll buy her a vacuum cleaner because I don't think that she has one. And if she does, then she'll, she's just going to have two. It's fine. Um, vacuum in miscellaneous. There we are. Um, she could have the super duper fancy one because she now has 84,000 simoleons. And that's not cheating. <laughs> I didn't cheat by moving her in with someone else. That's not what I did at all. Uh, right, can we empty this vacuum? Why is it full? It's brand new. Why is the vacuum full? And then vacuum around. I don't know. I don't know. That happened to me in another playthrough that I was doing as well. Brand new black vacuum cleaner out of the catalogue and it was full apparently. Right, the floor is clean. Um, what I will have her do is I'll have her 
have a shower and um, get some sleep and then we'll maybe chat with Pamela to get our social up and I'll see you guys in the morning. Okay, she slept all the way through. She slept all through the afternoon. It's now nearly 5 p.m. But it's hard to tell what time of day it is because there's a blizzard going on right now. It is Winterfest, so Father Winter should appear. I think it's like 8 p.m. So what I'll have Sonsi do as well is I'll have her cook a grand meal for us and our little teenage roommate over here. And we'll do a ham dinner. There we go. Um, because I don't think she's got any cooking skill. I think she's just made herself some um, eggs and toast and nearly burnt the kitchen there and it was kind of scary. Um, but I looked at her friend, uh, not her friendship panel, I looked at her family tree while Tennessee was sleeping and I feel like the reason that she's sad is because her her mom and dad have both passed away. Her dad was Jay Huntington III, as you may guess from her last name. And both her mom and dad have passed away of old age. So that's why she's sad and she's in this house all by herself. It's really sad. Why is she asking me parenting questions? I'm not a parent. I'm not, I've not adopted you. I just live here. It's fine. <laughs> I just live here. Oh, cooking level eight. Sweet. Leveling up. Why have I got parenting level one now? <laughs> What's going on? I'm not parenting. I'm not adopting this child. Nope, no, I'm not ready to be a parent to you. Uh-uh. Right, what are you watching? Is that like spooky black and white Twilight or something? Oh no, it's like a musical show. Right, we're making some ham dinner. And then call to dinner. Go, go, go. Call to grand meal. Ding, ding, ding. Come and eat some and then we can get this little bit ticked off. I think if we get that one ticked off and then get the presents thing ticked off and like... Is it yeah, talk to Father Winter? Then yeah, asking for a present, then that might count as a good holiday, which means we then get extra um, satisfaction points and lifetime points. And which means we can actually get... Whoa, whoa, whoa. You're not Father Winter. You're Data Flex, apparently. And who are you? Your darling surveyor. I don't know who these people are, but they are not Father Winter. To be fair, it's like 8pm, yeah. Um, whoa, 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 whoa. There he is. Is this Father Winter? Ah, you are not Father... Where's Clement Frost, you imposter? Rylan Irwin. This is not Father Winter. Excuse me. Where's Clement Frost? Actually, I've had this happen before in a game. Um, One of my sims married Father Winter before, and he was replaced with someone with a big red beard. It was They do have extra Father Winter sometimes, but no... Does that mean that Clement Frost has married someone then? For us to have a different Father Winter in this game, does that mean that Clement Frost has married someone or has died? Because he can't die. He's immortal. All right, let's go and ask him for a present. Hey, no, I'm going to fight you for a present. Goodness me. A flirty introduction with Father Winter. Calm yourself down, Serenity. Oh, oh, oh. oh, he did a ho, ho, ho. Bless him. Oh, come down, sir. Say hi. Oh, Charisma level 6. She is absolutely flowing through all of these extra skills today. And she got that one ticked as well. So she's got Father Winter ticked. She's got Grand Meal ticked. She does not have open presents, though. Kyoshi Spirits fading away. I don't know who Kyoshi is. Ode to Jazz 2. Golden Tips. Oh, she got a painting. Hmm. What's going on? What do we need to do? Festive Spirit. We can do Festive Spirit, can't we? We can do, like belly laugh and and stuff let me see in friendly complain about winterfest no i hate that that's first rather than sing about or enthuse about because it comes in alphabetical order i hate that whenever it's um a holiday the first thing that you can do is complain about it share winterfest spirit so yeah because s obviously comes after c in the alphabet uh, that's always at the end i hate that can I click on myself and go belly laugh? More choices, more choices. Why can I not belly laugh? Oh. That is belly laugh comes under yourself, doesn't it? That's not under someone else. Or is it under... Sting about winter fest. Is it under funny, maybe? I thought it was when you clicked on yourself. Funny. Oh, no, it is when you click on someone else. Excuse me, I am incorrect. Oh. Is that going to tick that off? I think if we can do festive spirit, we don't need to do the other two. And we'll still get a gold holiday give winterfest gift oh i have plenty of things that i can give you um, i'm not going to give you my degrees though no i can give you some pictures of some people that i met here yeah. have some random pictures of people that i met you might like those 
Can you give Father Winter a gift? You can. Here, have a random picture that I took of someone. Uh, yeah, you'll like it, I promise. I promise. Oh no, she didn't like the <laughs> she didn't like the random picture of someone that I took. Surprisingly. And is Father Winter gonna like it too? And also, are you just cooking everything everywhere? What are you making in here? Is he making a white cake? Do I have that nap on? Oh no. Right, I'm gonna vacuum like we'll go through the rest of of Winterfest. I'm gonna vacuum this floor. I'm gonna have her do some working out. And I will catch up with you when the scholarship comes in the mail. Okay, we've just got the mail. We're going to go and check to see if the scholarships have arrived. Let's see which ones we've been accepted for, if any. Hopefully. Fingers crossed. Okay, let's check in her inventory. We have... Ooh, six scholarship letter results. Ooh, does that mean was that all of them? I can't remember how many we applied for now. And the Great Outdoors yes okay so and this one is guys outdoors building the future food and drink future star and willow creep scholarship okie dokie so that's the thing we're gonna do is we're gonna apply for university so university um apply to university and we're gonna go to brightchester we're gonna do drama and we're gonna stay in the student housing um, um Swansea's university application is on the way. University will look over the application in the mail the results back sometime in the next few days. Okay, so I will come back to you when we get that application back in the post. I have to just show you something. I have to show you something. We haven't had the results from the university just yet, but someone just came to our house and gave us a gift. And look what it is. It's a violin! <laughs> after all this time it's a crafted violin there's one of those homemade ones but look it look it we got <laughs> we've got our violin after all this time i'm so happy i'm so pleased that we've got a violin but anyway i'll go back to waiting for the university application form now i just i needed to share i needed to share and you know why <laughs> Okay, the mail has arrived. It is Saturday morning. Let's go and check it. Also, you may notice that she's a, a little different looking. Um, she worked out a lot while we were waiting for the mail to arrive. Uh, let's go and see what we got. Uh, she's collected everything from the mailbox. And let's see, it should be an acceptance letter. <gasps> it is an acceptance letter. Can we read it? Let's read it. What does it say? Yay, we're in okay 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 let's let's go let's let's uh let's apply then let's um enroll that's the next thing we need to do right then enroll to university yes no. now we can enroll in and we're going to go to brightchester this time and we're going to do a drama distinguished degree and we're going to do all four classes as always because they've engaged in the quickest amount of time i only need to complete nine classes to graduate this time is that the way, is that how it's normally? It is, isn't it? I'm just, ignore me, ignore me. It's like two full semesters and then one with only one class, right? I wish that it would get smaller and smaller and smaller the more you went through. Um, So we've got comedic errors, taming the crew, um, measurement for measurement, and all's well that vends well. So I wonder what, I'm gonna guess that we're gonna have some um mischief in there somewhere, we'll see. We are going to stay not in the halls, but in the house, in Darkwing House. It looks like a little cottage, like from Henford on Bagley. Oh, I love. Uh, four beds, no gender restriction, no affiliation. Let's go. What are we going to get? We have to pay this time. We've got to pay some towards our degree this time. Are you kidding me? Um, we have our scholarships, don't we? Yes, we've got a drama degree class. And a class, and a class, and a class. It's four classes. Um, our housing costs, and then we've got all of our scholarships coming off there as well. So we do have to pay, but only four thousand. No, four thousand. No, but only four hundred and forty-five simoleons. That's not that bad, really. That's not that bad. We will leave um old Madam Pamela over here, but I am going to take all of my money with me. So we're going to take um how much is in our bank now? Eight three four three zero. There we go. Sorry, Pamela. You have no money left. That's all ours now. <laughs> I don't even know how much she had. She probably had 20,000 or something. 
it's ours now here we are oh i have never played in this house you know i have played in my own time off stream in that house that we just came from the one that we were in in foxbury institute i have never played in this house before let's have a look and see we have got a little living area here no tv just a sofa a chair a fireplace and a little dining area and a bookshelf that's nice a little kitchen again with no oven for some reason you can't put ovens in unless you go into free ball free build and change it there's a bit of a little dining space here though as well um a little computer so we don't need to get our laptop out even though we do have a laptop there is a computer already here some more bookcases um a downstairs bathroom with a shower and uh, we have another whoa huge tv in this one and uh, we've got another little seating area over here we've got a, a twin room in the downstairs and then upstairs we have another twin room so no big double bed and private bathroom for us this time unfortunately no ensuite bathroom this has got a little walk-in wardrobe area um but the bathroom is separate so where shall we stay who's the who's sleeping in this bed arush gupta no one in that one no one on that one no one on that one i think we'll have the downstairs bedroom i quite this is my favorite color so we're gonna assign this bed to us there we go that one's mine i don't want to sleep in the same room as arush gupta uh you know we'll keep girls in one room and boys in another room you know just in case there's talk in the town and she's very very t um tired and sore from all the work in it that she did by the way um right let's have a look at her schedule shall we we have um classes on monday we have classes on tuesday and that's it okay so the what day is it today it is saturday today she has no classes today no classes sunday um the first class that she'll have is monday which is taming of the crew and it's a fitness skill she already has like level 10 fitness so that'll be fine and that's an exam and then she has three classes on tuesday starting at 8 a.m 8 till 9 30 11 till 12 30 and then 1 30 until 3 so tuesdays and thursdays are going to be very full days like we're going to be going from 8 until 3 that's a long day um and then we have one two term papers and one presentation so i think what we should do is like we should take advantage of this first weekend because we're not going to have very much time during the actual degree take advantage of this first weekend get those term papers started get the presentation started at the very very least get that homework done for all the classes get that out that way um i'll get her doing that right now actually because otherwise i will forget right how is she needs why she's a little bit of a show but she's fine so let's get her on the computer very very first thing we'll do university um university coursework term paper write a term paper for all's well that vends well um sorry arush could you get off the computer please um thanks <laughs> we need it more than you do okay and then we'll get started on that it'll be nice to do a bit of drama so what were the other ones in i wasn't paying attention charisma and comedy i'm surprised i thought there would be a comedy one i'm surprised there isn't a mischief one but then i guess i guess drama isn't very mischievous is it i really thought that there would be acting skill involved but obviously acting as a skill comes with get famous and these are all base game skills that are included in the degrees because some people might not have get famous so they wouldn't be able to have that skill involved it would be cool though if there was if the, it could tell that you had extra packs and then say rather than having two charisma classes have one charisma class and and one acting class that might be fun and we're not doing any after school programs this time we're not going to do any sports clubs we're not going to do any esports clubs if we do take part in any clubs and we'll do it on our own terms okay are you gonna come and live with us you're not are you emory fitzpatrick he follow me around emory and who are you are you another one of our things Dur durum seems to be a quite common name in the sims at the moment durum seems to be sleeping are you sleeping in our room no 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 one's taken this other bed yet i wonder who's going to be sharing a room with us 
because there should be four people here. I've got a feeling that all four beds are going to be filled eventually. Hey, hey, friend. Oh, is he flirting with me? Did you see that heart shape there? Are you flirting with me, sir? That was a suggestive conversation. Did you see that? Hello? Okay, okay. Just, uh, I'll keep him on the back burner for later, maybe, when she's feeling a little bit low on the social, you know? Maybe he's going to be sharing this pink bed with us. Oh, no, we're getting a Hiroto Kuruma. Kimura. I said that wrong. <laughs> Kimura. So, are we the only woman in this house? Daruk Ayosura, Arush Gupta, and then, yeah, Hiroto, Kimura, and, and us. Yeah, we're the only woman staying in this household. That does not feel safe, but I'm sure it's going to be okay. Uh, okay, she's finished her first draft of her first term paper. That's fantastic. Go take a shower because you're a little bit stinky. And... Oh, you, oh, the chair wasn't even cool. Darn. Start jumping into... I was sitting down. Oh, my goodness. Right, before we go and do our next term paper and presentation, I will get her to start her homework because you know what she's like with homework. And when I say she, I mean me. You know what I'm like with her doing her homework. I always forget about it till the last minute and then she puts her homework book down and then we lose it. So if we can get all of her homework done before Monday, then at least it's all out of the way. I don't need to think about it because it's still only Saturday afternoon. If we can get a lot of this stuff done. Oh God, is that a bit too close to the... <laughs> EA built this. EA built this build. If that rug's too close to the fire and it sets on fire, I'm blaming EA, okay? I didn't build this. This is not off the gallery. This is not a game changers build. EA built this. I'm keeping an eye on you. <laughs> It'd be just our luck, wouldn't it? Oh, Arush doing his homework with us. Oh, I mean, we're a bit tired, but also we have homework to do. Comedic errors. I didn't check which is the names of the classes, did I? So the Monday class is the Taming of the Crew one. And then all the rest of the Tuesday, Thursday classes. Okay. Taming of the Crew. I wonder why we've got a, a fitness one for drama. I mean, I guess it's for like stunts and things, wouldn't it be? I guess that's their equivalent of putting like an acting class in because they couldn't put acting in. <gasps> Does somebody somebody's put a roast chicken down and you know what i haven't done yet i haven't moved in properly let's move in properly shall i um let me put my fridge in my room with my microwave on top of it and then if the fridge is in the room then uh so is the chicken so, yeah sorry i'm doing that i don't remember there being any roast chickens brought to us in our old house what the heck was that? Did you hear that? What the heck was that? There was like a big booming noise, like a TV or a stereo was on or something. But I don't feel like there's anything in here. That was strange. Are you gonna go? What are you gonna do? Are you napping? You have a bed. <gasps> Helen. Is Helen an elder? I mean, she always had that silver hair, didn't she? But I don't. I can't tell whether she's a an elder. She is. Helen, she had like a silvery light brown hair before. <gasps> Helen's an elder, which reminds me, how close to aging up are we? <sighs> Oof, we're only three days away. Uh, we better take our aging potion. I think I got her one to sit in her inventory. Did I not? We have plenty of um points though. Yeah, we've got 21,000 points. I think we're okay. Let's grab her a, an anti-aging potion. Before I forget, because then she'll only drop and I will be sad. Potion of Youth. There we go. Purchase the Potion of Youth. And actually, while we're in there, whilst we're in the reward store, let's have a look and see if there's any traits that we could possibly take that might be good for us. Now, like I said before, I don't want to really use any of these that will like, stop us from having any needs. Like, maybe later on, but... I, I don't like them, first of all. I mean, I've got the Savant one. Um, professional Slack is more about having a job. Hardly hungry, I don't want. I don't need that one. Great kisser. Not fertile. Not yet. Not yet. Um, connections is about careers. Carefree, maybe. Let's never get tense, though. 
I think I'm going to get that one. I think I'm going to get carefree to never get tense. That's good. Antiseptic. Um, steel bladder. These are ones that she doesn't need. Like the knees don't decay as quickly. I'm, like, I'm not too sure about those. Beguiling. Beguiling might be a good one to have. Independent means their social need decay is slower. Incredibly friendly. Okay, we'll get the friendly one. Ice proof and heat proof, maybe. We'll see how she copes with the temperatures. Frugal is lower bills. Uh, we're not really paying bills at the moment. Entrepreneurial is to do with your career. Creative visionary, yes. Because I need her to paint some masterpieces and write some bestsellers for her aspirations. So that's going to be useful. And we've got 12 or more traits. Nice. Um, stove um, and girls master is not that important. Marketable, not yet because we're not really making anything in our spurs. Um, free, free services, we're not really using services right now. Storm chaser, I'll have her have because then she won't get tense from the storm or scared from the storm, I should say. Speed reader, that's a good one for reading books. I don't want to use up all of her points because obviously she's going to need some extra um, potions of youth going forward mentor nah and then all these here are extra little potions speed cleaner that might be useful sacred candles no waterproof no curse cleansing no observant nah, nah. gym rat i thought i already got a gym rat but there we go i'll give her gym rat um always welcome is a good one um sleep replacement lifestyle go poof and then all of these are little potions. I think that will do for now. We've got some extra traits going on. She's very tired and she needs to pee. So can I have her go a wee wee and then go a sleepy buys? There we go. Go a wee wee and go a sleepy buys. And then she might feel better for the afternoon. Is he still here, Emery? Is Emery broken? Emery might be broken. He's just been sat there. <laughs> like you let me in no we're not gonna let you oh, oh off he goes off he goes maybe he's not broken after all he's just persistent oh here's our roommate hey how you doing hiroto hi hey how you doing we're also hungry but that's what i could hear is there fireworks going on oh is there like a match going on here ah uh... ah uh... Um, Friday, what day? It was Saturday. Yeah, Saturday's at 6 p.m. I bet it was here at the football game. Uh, okay, okay, that makes more sense now because we we're right next to the sports hall. That's what that noise was. Are there any other houses around here? Like, you know, in Foxbury Institute, your one house and like a little cul de sac of all little student houses all look identical. I feel like we're the only house here. Like, these are houses where I, they don't look the same as this. Unless these are the student houses. But they all look different. Well, that's fine. That's fine. So she's had a little bit of sleep. I am going to wake her up. It is ridiculously early on a Sunday morning to wake up. But I want her to have some roast chicken leftovers. Uh, where is the... There, get leftovers. Have that. <laughs> have the roast chicken leftovers. Why are you eating upstairs? Why? Why? Why did she go? <laughs> what? There's a dining. There are two dining tables downstairs, and she goes upstairs to eat on someone's desk. If this is not pure serenity energy, I don't know what is. And then she needs to. And then she needs to do her other term paper, her other homework, and start her presentation. Um, I'll have her do her homework. Cause I feel like that's more pressing at the moment. After she's eaten. There we go. Now I know I'm going to have to cut a lot. I will have cut a lot out of this video because of the waiting around time while we're waiting for our scholarships and stuff. Um, so I'm not sure how long this episode is going to be. Did you not do your homework? Excuse me, madam. Oh, you did. Measurement for measurement. Um, so what I'll do is I will... I'll have her do her homework now. I'll have her do her presentation like the start of her presentation and then i think i'll call it after that so that she's ready for monday morning when she goes to do her first class okay so what i had her do was i've had her do all of her homework i had her do her 
other first draft of her other term paper and capture information for her presentation so basically she is ready to go ready for the next day's classes um i will show you quite quickly that there she is there's her presentation board first one done it's poor quality and on the computer if i go to university coursework term paper um right we've got all's well the ellen's well well ven's well is poor and the comedic errors is poor but they are done they are done and if i check then here all of her homework is complete so she is ready to go ready and wearing for class it is 5 30 p.m right now so when we come back next week we will go through as many days as i can in one episode of her first semester we'll get as much as we can done and i will see you then i hope you enjoyed today's episode if you did please do leave a like on it and if you're new here don't forget to hit subscribe and if you think other people might enjoy this content don't forget to hit share as well and um, come follow me on my socials they are going to be linked down in that description and as always come check me out over on twitch tuesday through to friday at 10 30 british time and that is also linked down in that description i will see you next week and i hope you have a great day bye Thank you.